Yo. Oh! Crack up. Should we eat this one? Yes. How's it going team? Welcome back to Muddy Feet. Today is my first ever fly fishing video. Today I'm going to be targeting trout in the beautiful Nongataha with my mate and fly fishing legend, Shannon. Right, that's the introductions out of the way. First things first, we need to get our hands on some deadly flies. Which one's the very best one? <laughs> that's the one that we want. <laughs> what are you doing? Fly fishing up yeah, the... Yeah, going to go down normal. Well, what about... The yeah, the 101s? Yep. Sweetie. Two rubber legs. Are they supposed to look like the rubber? The rubber. Yeah. Ah, yeah, I thought so. Once we'd selected a handful of flies, we made our way down to the river where Shan tied up our rig. Put the pressure on you now, eh? Yeah, but <laughs> nice. Today we're going to be using three flies all tied into a daisy chain. This one here is called the rubber legs, I believe. And the little pink one, I'm not sure what the name is, but that one's supposed to look like a bit of trout row. And the last one here, I think it's called a grey ghost. So that's our rig for today. Three little flies all tied together. We made our way down to the first spot and Shannon fired in a cast. I was watching very closely because I needed to try and suss out the basics. I don't know much about this fly fishing and this was my opportunity to learn. Basically what you want to do is get your flies to float down through those darker deeper patches where there's likely to be a trout hiding and present that fly nicely right in front of his face. If you're lucky, he'll eat and you should be able to notice the indicator stop moving or possibly even give a little bob. And that's exactly when you want to strike. So... When you do get a bite though, if you're on the ball, you try and strike it straight away, a little bite, yeah, okay, so. It was all quiet at the first spot, so we decided to relocate to spot number two, just down by this bridge here. True bro. Nice easy spot. That's pretty cool. This is cool bro. It's a big trout just over there. I can see the dog. Just over there. I don't think that's one behind it bro. Oh you're on? Oh, was that a bite though? No. Oh. Yeah, 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 the bro's on, he's on, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh we forgot the net, yeah, we're on. Eesh. Oh, he got off. Unfortunately, this fish spat the hooks, but the spot was looking a lot more fishy. Man, it's a shame that they puttied it up, bro. I 
decided it's about time I had a turn at this fly fishing and I've spotted a trout over by the riverbank here. So I try to present the fly right in front of his face and sure enough, well bam, I'm hooked up. <laughs> I gave it a fairly good crack but I couldn't catch a sausage so I handed it back over to the main man. We needed some decent video of somebody catching some trout. Oh. We're hooked up, we're hooked up. <laughs> Oh, there's ducks over there. He's real skinny. He's a brown. He is a brown. Nice fish, bro. Does it look at them? Nice. Ooh. Skinny brown trout. He's not in the best condition, this fellow. We're going to pop him back. He's on. Yee -hee. Got the dog, bro. He's hooked up. It's a nice fish. It's quite a nice one. Oh, do I, oh. He's still there. We got him. <laughs> Did the hook pop out? Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Be a good eater, eh? Yeah. Beautiful. Very nice fish, bro. Me? Oh well. Does he look like a good eater? Yeah. Good enough condition, eh? Yeah, it'd be nice and orange flesh. Sweet, bro. That's a dinner. Yeah. Got the dog. Yep. So when the hooks popped out of the trout's mouth and flew up there and got itself stuck in the tree, we're going to see how good the bro can climb. <laughs> this is my normal experience with fly fishing. It's more like that. And the blackberry even, eh bro? Ratchet. Shannon successfully managed to recover our flies out of the tree and fired them straight back out there. And almost as soon as they hit the water, well bam, he was hooked up again. But this time he asked me oh, if I yeah, wanted to have a bit of a jam and of course I couldn't resist. So he handed it over so at least today I could have a bit of a practice at catching one of these fish. That's it, bro. Pretty strong for a little fish. Yeah, yeah, he is. Okay. That was on the grey ghost. On the grey ghost. Mean, nice little fish. So is that a hen, that one? Yeah, bro. Yep. See, it's got the curve. It's got no hook on it. Yep. The yeah, the, got the jack's got a bit of a hook, eh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah and they've got the real little smaller head. Yep. Sweet. Oh well. Put them back. I guess so. Oh.
<laughs> What's that? <laughs> How's it going, bro? Uh, right Cheer up, bro. Nice to nice meet you, bro. Nice a bit of a cast. Yeah. yeah. On. Crack up. Well, this is a nice condition one, eh? Oh, yeah. Sweet. Are we, should we eat this one? Yep, we'll eat this one. <laughs> Unlucky, mate. <laughs> it looks like a good eater, eh? Sweet. <laughs> nice to meet you too, bro. Oh, I'm all slimed up now, brother. Oh, all good, boy. All good. Nice to meet you, bro. Nice fish, bro. Cracking it. That was a mean one. Saw that happening. Bro, well, that's a good one. That looks bigger than the other ones. Yeah, that's a bit bigger, I think. It's a solid one. Yeesh. Nice fish. Look at that one. Bro, that's a beauty. You have been selected. Sorry, mate. Well, we changed the right flies, I think, bro. Yeah, bro. Great fish. Yeah, yeah, got the strike and everything, mean. He's on, he's on. That fish was playing us for a while. Yeah, bro. Yeah, he. There's a bit of action. It's jumping. Oh, yeah, bro. Oh, right up there with his mates. <laughs> Let that one go, eh? Beautiful fish. That's a good size one, bro. All right, little trout. There you go, mate. <laughs> Out of there. With three beautiful trout in the bag to take home for the table, we decided to call it a day and make a plan for tomorrow. So tomorrow we can just catch and release. Hello? Tomorrow we'll be able to just catch and release. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll try and catch something tomorrow. I'll do better tomorrow. Yeah, bro, I've got a bit of a bag going here for it. Beautiful fish, bro. Well done. Solid effort. Some very pretty fish. Mean. Yeah, it's pretty bountiful when you can go in the middle of the day and get three nice trout, you know? Yeah, it's pretty good going, man. How for you, Auntie? Okay, the biggest one. 
Oh yeah, yeah sweet, yeah. sorted. Didn't even make it back to the car and there's one trout less. <laughs> awesome stuff. That's what it's all about. We ended up giving away all of the catch from today because we figured out we could catch some more tomorrow because we had plans to be up at the crack of dawn and run it back. Hooked up before the sun's even up. Oh, there he goes. See him making a run down there. Good nice fish. Lucky fish, <laughs> he got away. Okay, we'll get the next one. That old chestnut when they spit the hook right there, eh? He's all. Going for the snag. Quite a big trout. Good size on those. Yeah. My hook's here. Yeah. Let's hook that glow bug. Cracker. That was already in there. His hook caught another little hook. It was stuck in the fish. And tied to that fly that was already in the fish's mouth. Crack up. <laughs> bro, that's a nice size one, bro. Lucy. Good stuff, brother. Good size one too. Bigger than yesterday's fish, eh? Very nice size fish. Beautiful, healthy rainbow. Good stuff. So that's a nice jack, eh? So you can tell by the undershot jaw, the hook on the jaw, that that's a jack. Yeah. Nice one. Nice fish, man. A few other locals had turned up and had started catching some really nice sized fish. So I decided to jump back on the rod and try and catch myself one of these trout. Yo! Oh! I hooked one. Unfortunately, I pulled the hooks on this one, but this gave me a bit of hope. I finally hooked one, so I casted and casted and casted again, and sure enough, I got another take. And this time, wha bam, I was hooked up. Yes. Yeah. 
Yeah. Mean bro. Got the dog. It's a little jack. Little jack on the nymph. Mean. Beautiful little rainbow. They are Good stuff, bro. Stoked. Alright, let's still find the game. Right, pretty fish. Mean. On the board, bro. <laughs> Epic. I was pretty stoked to have finally landed my first legit rainbow trout on fly. As far as I was concerned, it was mission complete. We'd had a pretty awesome morning, I'd managed to film lots of trout getting caught, and I'd managed to finally nail one myself. So we decided to call it a day and head back to the bro's place for a nice hot cuppa and a debrief. I want to say a massive, massive thank you to Shannon for your hospitality during my time here and thank you for taking me out for a few epic trout fishing missions. To all of you legends at home, I hope you've enjoyed this week's episode and as always, thank you for watching.